Hey, hold on, y'all. Check this out. So, Scott Matt, Matt out, right? A reporter for Fox 13 he was arrested for domestic assault, right? As you can see here, Scott Matt out, 42, a reporter of Fox 13, was arrested Saturday night. According to the affidavit, he and the victim began fighting at his midtown home after drinking a few glasses of wine, which upset the victim because Matt out had been sober for 20 days. <laughs> the victim who told the police that Maddow drinks often as it has anger issues told Maddow she was leaving to stay with a friend and locked herself in a room. That's when, according to the affidavit, Maddow stood in front of the door and the victim asked him, What are you doing? Are you not going to let me leave? She told police that she heard, it, heard the slide of a handgun racking before Maddow began punching and kicking the door. See, what happens is, when you own these handguns, you're not supposed to be drinking. And if you actually get caught in a situation where you end up like that, if you are intoxicated with that weapon, they automatically take your weapon, and temporarily you won't be able to have it or that license until the case is solved. That's another story. Once inside, Maddow allegedly he punched, pushed, and pushed her and began vandalizing the room. When officers arrived, they reported seeing the home vandalized vandalizing and observing a scratch on the victim's cheek. According to the affidavit, Maddow was standing behind the bar in the kitchen. He, beca he became irate and yelled at officers, get out of my house. You're not allowed to be here. And Maddow posted bond on Sunday morning. He is expected to be at court Monday morning. But ladies and gentlemen, Fox 13 is an op. And WREG is CBS affiliate. As you can see here, let me zoom in. News Channel 3, ladies and gentlemen, it is a CBS affiliate, as you can see here. All right. And they got it at the top. And that is crazy. So News Channel 3 <laughs> does a report. What the hell is this? Does a report on the app. Funny, isn't it? 